Am I the asshole for telling my sister to leave because of her fear? My, 22M, sister, 17F, is afraid of snakes, she hates them, can't be near them. My boyfriend, 21M, is the opposite, he loves them, and we actually have one, 2F. Because of this we normally go see her or if she comes to our place my BF sister will take our girl for the day. So, we have a pool, and it's been really hot where we live so we invited my sister and my parent round. Like normal my BF sister came and took our snake. When they arrived everything was fine until we got into the pool. My boyfriend has a tattoo of a snake. It's a blacked out silhouette that wraps around both of his arms and his back. When my sister saw it she freaked out and told me to tell him to cover it. She knew about his tattoo, she just expected him to cover it, which he can't do without putting on a long sleeve t-shirt. I told her no. She then went over to him and asked him to leave because he knows about her fear. This annoyed me and I told her that if she has an issue with it she should leave. This is his house, not hers. She got upset and just sat inside the whole time. When they left my mom told me that I was rude to my sister and we knew about her fear and that we ruined her day. Now I'm starting to think that I could have handled the situation better. So am I the asshole? And hash x200b. Edit. I've been talking to someone in DMs and they said I should add some stuff we talked about to my post. My BF's tattoo is very important to him. We got our current baby after his old snake dies. The tattoo is based on a picture of his old snake draped over his back and arms. Also, self-expression is very important to my BF. He grew up in a very restrictive household. His mother controlled what he did, how he acted and what he wore. We didn't just move our snake because her enclosure is built into a large bookcase in our living room. Also, this only happens once every month or so, we normally visit her. Also my BF sister is a huge reptile nerd and loves our little girl almost as much as we do. My boyfriend actually has an irrational animal fear of his own, butterflies. He knows that not all phobias work the same but he thinks that her asking him to leave is ridiculous. Also when I say that it's his house I mean it's his house, not ours. Also to the few people asking how a 21-year-old can afford a house with a pool. My boyfriend has been in the entertainment industry since he was a kid, think child actor, model. He hated it and no longer does it. If your sister is so afraid of snakes that even a tattoo of one is going to make her freak out, then she has a problem. She needs to leave your lovely pool and sew home and think about getting sewn therapy. Not the asshole edit to add. Thank you, you, underscore username too long for the award also. Thank you, to, you, chad underscore also. Thank you, you, tfroggy also. Thank you, you, r fardina okr. Not the asshole. If she really is afraid of a tattoo of a snake, she needs serious therapy. Imagery of snakes are everywhere and that's a very intense phobia of true. To be honest though this just seems like BS. Fears are hard to face and confront but it seems weird to me that she has no problem making you all jump through hoops for her. Having a fear or phobia is very understandable but the whole world can't realistically change for you. Not the asshole. First, there's no way you could have known her fear of snakes would extend to a tattoo. I would not have thought that a tattoo would evoke the same level of fear as an actual snake. Two, you were doing a nice thing by inviting your sister to use the pool. You did not have to do this. You already went above and beyond by removing your snake from your home. Three, if a guest doesn't like something about the place, people they are visiting, they leave. They do not expect, especially in the middle of the current world situation, people to leave their own homes so the guest can be comfortable. Not the asshole either your sister is faking it or she needs psychiatric help for a severe phobia neither of which you can do anything about. That she would voluntarily come over to a house where she knows a snake resides even though it's not there, says she more than likely faking it. I'm sorry, family is nuts. Please leave your house so we can use your pool. Thinking face you're already getting your baby out the house. That's more than enough. Most people would not even do that. I'm sorry for her phobia but she's being unrealistic as is your parents. Maybe she needs to see someone. Whilst family might be accommodating, the real world will not. She needs to learn to cope with images. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. I am terrified of snakes and spiders.
But I would never expect somebody to even temporarily rehome their pet snake or spider and a tattoo of those does not frighten me. You sister needs therapy serious therapy. It's time to stop catering to her fear in your home. Not the asshole. It's a tattoo, not an actual snake, and your sister has no right to tell you or boyfriend what to do or wear in your own home. Frankly, if her fear is that bad that she can't even see a picture then she probably needs therapy of some kind. There is no way that she can go through her entire life never seeing anything to do with snakes. Your mom needs to mind her own business in your home. Not the asshole. She asked him to leave his own house and your mom thinks you were the one who was rude? Even if she wasn't overreacting, that's my suspicion, and she was paralyzed in fear, it still doesn't justify asking someone to leave their own house. Not the asshole. Your sister and mother sound like total mental cases. Not the asshole. Getting the actual snake out while she's around is a bigger step than most people would take. If it were me it'd be, if you don't want to find the snake, don't open doors. Your sister needs to learn that while she can have phobias and triggers, she can only get upset at someone intentionally triggering her. At the very least she needs some counselors to figure out why her phobia is that severe. Not the asshole. Bruh this is ridiculous. What did she seriously expect? Not the asshole I hate snakes. But I would never expect someone to remove their pet for me, and a tattoo? Not the asshole. That level of fear needs serious therapy. It's a tattoo for crying out loud. It's not real. She asked her boyfriend to leave his own house so she could enjoy his swimming pool? That's insanity. He was nice enough to have his sister take his snake home with her. Your mother also sucks for not taking her to therapy and for treating groups and your boyfriend like the bad guy in the situation. Not the asshole but can I say that I love that you I dead your snake's age and gender? As someone you suffers ophidiophobia, not the asshole. She needs to learn to live with images of snakes in her life. It sucks because I know I personally get quite panicky seeing images in my feed but it's not up to others to police themselves for us. We have to learn to deal with our phobia. Thank you for telling us the age and sex of the snake. Not the asshole. It's your home. You're already going above and beyond by removing your pet from the property. I'd be like, nope my pet lives here. This room will remain closed. Don't go in, and be done with it. Having a phobia so much that you're going to overreact when you see a tattoo that you already know exists? Sorry. Your sister needs a therapist. It is absolutely ridiculous to demand that your boyfriend not enjoy the pool that he pays for, so that your entitled sister can use your property. Nope. She can either deal with it or not come over. It's her phobia and thus her issue to deal with. Not the asshole I'm not sure how she expects to go through life and never see a single image of a snake. It's pretty ridiculous. Lol not the asshole where does she get off making demands to someone in their own home? Not the asshole. Where does your sister get off asking you to make your boyfriend uncomfortable, in his own home, then turn around and ask him to cover up? Not the asshole if her fear is so bad it extends to seeing pictures. She needs help. Not the asshole your sister is insane and your mom has normalized her insanity. Not the asshole. I hate those reptiles, flinch reading the word and can't bring myself to type the S word. But you see pics of them everywhere and have to just avert your eyes. She's young and scared and overreacted. Your mom, as the parent, should have calmed it all down instead of automatically taking her side and accusing you of being rude for your very sensible reaction. You didn't even ask sis to leave your home after asking your boyfriend to leave. She went to chill in your lounge. Dot. I mean does your mom expect that your sis will never see images? Not the asshole your sister sounds like a big dramatic baby. I'm betting she makes lots of demands for special accommodations. YTA for not including a snake tax. Obviously not the asshole though. Not the asshole, it's your house. Honestly if her phobia of snakes is so bad that she can't be around a tattoo of one, she should probably consider some therapy. This annoyed me and I told her that if she has an issue with it she should leave. This is his house, not hers. This right here. When I was a little kid, I was afraid of sheep. We had one of those kiddie pools with various pictures printed on it, including pictures of sheep. I didn't demand that my mom get a new pool or cover up the sheep. I just didn't use the pool. Not the asshole. Not the asshole she needs therapy. That is beyond unreasonable. Even if that, possibly fake, 
Fear wasn't there. Asking your boyfriend to leave to use his pool is insanely rude. I laughed out loud that you added the 2F when you mentioned your snake. That's adorable. But no, not the asshole. I have a phobia of an animal myself, not snakes. But the only thing I'm afraid of is the actual animal. Not a photo or tattoo of one. Because I'm a grown up and I know tattoos can't hurt me. Sounds like your sis was just fishing for attention. Not the asshole. Phobias are, in general, irrational, so I'm not going to shame your sister on that front. But can be so entitled to ask someone to leave their own house? Um, excuse you? How is that perfectly acceptable behavior? Oh for the love. I am terrified of birds, but a tattoo of birds does not send me into fits. I can even appreciate a live bird from afar. Your sister is being ridiculous. I still blame. Alfred Hitchcock. Not the asshole. Not the asshole snake tax. Not the asshole. You ruined her day? She was at your house trying to enjoy your pool. She was trying to run your boyfriend's day dictating what have wants him to wear at his own house. Info because I'm curious. What does your mom mean by, her day? Is this a celebration for your sister? Not that it really changes my verdict though. Not the asshole I would stop inviting sister over. Her fear doesn't excuse her behavior. Not the asshole. She doesn't get to dictate what someone wears in his own home. If her phobia is that bad, she should have left. Love that you included the age and gender of the snake LMAO. Enabled much. Tell mom at 17 she is going to have to grow up asking someone to swim in a long sleeve shirt is ridiculous and if she can't see that therapy is need for both sis and mom. Not the asshole. Oh good grief. Not the asshole. I hate snakes too. Terrified of them. World class, ophidiophobe. But even I wouldn't dream of trying to make someone leave his own home because of my phobia. She needs to see a therapist and learn how to deal with her fear. It can be done. I really appreciate how you gave your snake an age and a gender in this story. Also, not the asshole. Leaning to not the asshole because of the mom. But if it's about the sister I think I'll say nah. Obviously she shouldn't expect her boyfriend to cover his tattoo, and you were in the right for telling her she can leave. But to have a phobia that severe could be a sign that she needs psychiatric help. There are people who can't control those visceral reactions to their phobic triggers, and therapy can help a lot. Maybe talk with her about finding help for her fear? If she doesn't get help that could hinder her quite a bit in life. I'm just here to say I think it's so cute that you included the age and gender of the snack in the story. Less than three. If your sister is afraid of a picture of a snake she needs therapy, not enabling. Not the asshole. I love how you gave the snake an age and gender. Say hi to her for me. Not the asshole if she's that scared of snakes that an unrealistic tattoo freaks her out then she needs therapy. I wouldn't remove my snake from my home for anyone it's needless stress that can cause many problems and my animals come before anyone's comfort. Don't like it don't come over. Not the asshole your sister is either being dramatic for attention or has a real issue that needs to be dealt with by her, not others. Not the asshole. I have the same phobia and couldn't go near a house that has a snake in. I'd freak out about the tattoo too. However it's my problem to deal with. It would be nice if your boyfriend covered up but I wouldn't expect him to. I'm deathly scared from snakes but I'm not gonna get scared from tattoo that's stupid. Not the asshole. It's a tattoo. Your sister is either being dramatic or needs psychological help. Not the asshole sweet lord. If her phobia is so bad that a tattoo sets her off, there's a need for counseling, therapy.